Okay, this is Crazy Joe Video Chronicles here. And my saying is on you, you cock. If I got something to say, I'm going to say it. First of all, I want to talk about landlords. Landlords are scumbags. They're the lowest pieces of, of fucking human feces dog shit just like you people are. So you're in the same family. So you got company, you bunch of scumbags out there. Because you're scumbags just like uh, like landlords are. And unfortunately, uh, I have to answer to them. Because I'm a uh, professional renter. And, uh, but... I am extremely happy that I'm going to start my life. My new venture is going to start pretty soon. I'm going to have, hopefully, uh, peace and quiet within the uh, rental community. Because I mind my own business. I don't bother anybody. I bother you fucking assholes because you're a bunch of jerk-offs. But I don't bother other people. I keep quiet to myself. And the only thing I care about right now, which you people don't understand because you're a bunch of fucking jerk-offs and losers. You never heard my show, so you don't know how good or how bad my show is. But I guarantee you I am a winner. And I have a lot of people out there who are jealous of me because I'm from New York and I'm a bad motherfucker from the old days of New York. Not the new days, which is people like you, you young, ignorant fucking cocksuckers. You know nothing about life. You're you can't even balance a checkbook. You don't want it. You're too lazy to change a tire. Um I'll give an example of what I'm talking about. I got a yuppie fucking neighbor here, a female, um, who's young and is a school teacher, lives by herself, doesn't have is lazy. I mean lazy to go to the laundromat and do her fucking laundry. It's pretty pathetic, isn't it? Um, me? Okay, I don't have a profession like her. And maybe that's an excuse for her to pay for someone to do a laundry. Because that is a service that is obtainable. But, I guarantee you in the old days... When women were on there, if they were lucky enough to be on their own, a lot of them always hooked up with a man to suck his dick and take his money. Um, that women back in the old days were independent enough to wash, to cook, to clean, do the things that they don't want to do today because of the feminist ideology. So, a lot of these women are are very lazy today. And even if you don't have the time, you can always make the time to do your laundry, your wash, clean a house, whatever. Just because you're a single woman doesn't give you the right or the excuse not to do housework. And laundry is a part of housework because of this new generation today of... And I did a video... The other day, this new generation of laziness. And that's the problem with you fucking douchebags. That's why I can't fucking stand you. And I will never fucking like you. And I will always have bad things to say about you because you breed bad things. Because of your laziness and your irresponsibility to do things that are important to do. That are responsible to do. You see? You can say anything you want about me. But motherfuckers. I'll tell you something about me motherfuckers. I'm the most responsible person that I know. And I did know other people. In our generation. That were just as responsible. If not more than me. But I learned from them. You cocksuckers don't learn anything. The only thing you learn. Is how to be a dork. and, And be a fucking scumbag dickwad. Being on the computer all day and on your cell phone all day and riding a unicycle with no seat down a bumpy road of life. And stay on the corner sucking dick for milk money. Technology wise. Because that's all you kids are about. Technology. See, I got nothing against technology, but I go, but you know what? Technology is not my life. Technology is substituting things that you jerk offs 
don't even know anything about. For instance, uh, taxi and limousine rides are done through apps. Ordering food is done through apps. Even more, li- there was always delivery guys. But now they got apps. And you can order from multiple places. Therefore, increasing your laziness and your inefficiency to be a human fucking being. But I know you scumbags don't understand that because you grow up in this fucking generation X of incompetency, irresponsibility. You don't even know what responsibility is. You don't know what going out is. You don't know what having a good time is. No, you only know how to be on your goddamn cell phone all day on your computer and be a fucking loser. That's all you know. You don't know what life is about. About having a good time, getting some fresh air. Going out to a park, having a picnic. Nah. You rather stay in your miserable fucking dungeons. Which is your room or whatever the fucking dwelling it is. It's probably the fucking basement. Well, you wear a life preserver because it gets so flooded down there. Because that's where your mommy and daddy put you in. And you're on the fucking day, all day, playing video games and on the fucking computer and not being a human being. You're being a subhumanoid dog shit, zombie piece of dog shit. Now, I've made a lot of videos before. This is the most intelligent video I've ever made because it specifically attacks you jerk offs for doing what you're doing. You are a disgrace to the human race. You should be all ashamed of yourselves. But you're going to continue to be a bunch of dork, loser, cocksuckers. And this is the generation that's going to take over for future. We're going to have dorks like you in the Congress or in government. Or being mayors or whatever, city representatives. If you can't balance a checkbook or not willing to change a tire, you don't deserve to be in office. Or you don't deserve to be with a, uh, well, the only jobs you're probably going to get is high tech jobs. Because that's so, you'd be like this, well, I've got a high tech job because it's like playing videos all day. <laughs> I'm so lucky. Meanwhile, we need other jobs that are important, public service jobs. But no, you're going to get the geek squad jobs because you're a bunch of fucking dorks, a bunch of losers. (laughs) See, I represent the working class, the people that struggle, that know what it is to struggle. They're not playing geek squad games or playing video games and sucking dick for milk money in the corner. Like you fucking jerk offs too. And that's why we have to bring in all these illegal immigrants to do the jobs that jerk offs like you should be doing. Not as a career, but to train you responsibility. Because there's no nothing more humbling than doing a job that's you know, whatever, labor job, public service job, food industry, whatever. You learn responsibility. You learn what a real job is all about. You know? Not like when your mom says, hey, uh, Josh, it's time to clean up the garage. You go, oh, no, ma, let Manuel do it. He was the one that mowed our lawn last week. I don't want to do that. I want to play video games. And I want to talk to my friends on Facecraft and YouTube. You are scumbags, you know that? You are the lowest form of dog shit. You're subhumanoid. You don't even belong in our society. You're poison to our world. I wish I could bring back the real workforce. Scale back on the technology. We were closer as a country back then. When we had unions. When we had industrial work. I wouldn't mind mixing it with a little technology. 
but not to make you fucking scumbags, the scumbags that you are today. Go fuck yourselves. Crazy Joe Searle said that. Wait, I, I didn't think I said that clearly. I think I was in the middle of hiccup. Crazy Joe Show said that. 